Aloha! This is the Green Lis Lightning Mr. T. Last episode we beat the boss and got a ton of upgrades while forgetting that I'm on a trying to do 20 minute videos. Anyways, right now I'd like to head to where we're supposed to be going. Um, if you... Uh, get out of the way! Oh, apparently I forgot they die in water. Anyways, we got a magic jar! Woohoo! I have no use for it. But apparently these guys die in water. <laughs> I can kill them! They actually drop me bombs, that's kind of nice. Oh yeah, that's from the... In the fields, like, all the leaves drop all sort of good items, so you don't have to go to the stores and get them. Like, bombs and ducky nuts, seeds, maybe, I have no idea. Okay. So you're gonna talk to me, so... Yay! Yeah, yeah, we've only met, like, you know, about a couple minutes ago. And you, you're deciding not to let me skip your dialogue, so... <laughs> Kinda weird how some of them are skippable and some are not. You're, you're all over the place, really. So yes, oh, that's because you aren't going to ask me if I want to listen again. Okay then. So we got a gold scotilla. Hooray. Um, what's down here? Are these rupees? Yeah, no. Okay. Or is this actually a spot you can do that? No, it is not. Oh, uh, oh well. Well, I, don't, I only didn't get to lose anything for it. In fact, I practically gained because I got the bombs back and Deku Seeds. Okay, so this guy, he is pretty important. Um, give me a moment. Okay, I'm back. Medical call. As I said, I did have, my family has had a medical emergency, and that was a call about that. Okay. Alright. Should be able to cut this out, because I'm not, I'm no longer, I'm, <laughs> I have time to not be lazy about editing. Anyways. Okay, so this guy, he's, he sells beans. Magic beans, and just beans in general. So, basically, the, the, the gimmick about this guy is that each time he sells them, because he's running out of stock, he increases their price. He's got ten in total. Also, there's a, a bit of soft soil next to him at the surface of the tutorial. And I believe that's... There's, I, there's either one or two soft soils that actually don't have golden scotulas in them, so... Um, that's just for planting, if I remember right. And they're getting to be quite popular, apparently. So basically, we need to... Well, technically we don't need to do this, since I'm not going for heart pieces. But, they're useful all the same, and I'd like to show them all off anyway, so... I will be doing that. Also, I have to get the Golden Skull Tulas from all of them, so I figure I might as well do um, get the, do the Golden Skull Tulas and the Magic Beans at the same time. So, as you can see, I am out of money. This is problematic. Um, so. How do I want to do this? You know what? I have an I. Well, do I want to do it that way? Because I kind of want to do another mini game. Slash, go get more money for this guy. I'll just wait until I have more money. 
and then I'll make another visit back. And then I'll do the mini game. I guess I could do it something like that. Alright, I'm gonna do this in a kind of awkward way. I'm gonna be doing the main quest and then going off quest and then doing the main quest again or something along those lines. And I don't have to worry about those hard pieces right now, so I am free to do as I please. Now honestly, there's you can play the song like a song for the frogs down there and get rupees, but I'm not even gonna go near that because that's an heart piece involved. So I'm not even gonna go near that. Said so I'm gonna press onward and hope for something useful out of that rock. Who puts all how are these bombs and whatnot get in these rocks anyways? Huh, anyways. Oh, 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 it's nighttime. I might as well get this golden scatula here that spawns here. Right on this ladder, there's a golden scatula! And it decided to turn just nighttime for me to get that. Hooray! So here we need to do as Gabor said and play the uh, royal family song thing. I don't know, it says, it always calls it Zelda's, Zelda's Lullaby when it's the royal family and song thing. Is that weird that it's just not called the royal family song thing? I don't know, I, I can't remember. Royal family song, like... I don't know. Never mind. Zora's Domain! Welcome to the world of Zora's! Um, thinking, thinking, thinking... I believe this would be the first time... ...that these Zoras were introduced. These are... ...well, oddly enough, not River Zor. Even though they live... ...at the base of a river. That makes no gosh dang sense, actually. <laughs> Anyways... Whoa, who are you? We are the Zoras, the proud aquatic people. So you have some connection with the Hyrule's royal family. Whoa, what do you want from us? Well, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just here on circumstance, basically. If you actually play... Um, Navi's hint is basically telling you to ask... <coughs> 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 Ooh, sorry about that. It came upon me all of a sudden. Um, is um, and just ask Sarah what we should do next, and she will tell you to that she heard about the Zora Sapphire or something like that. So that's our reason to come here, at any rate. And the king is worried about his her his, his daughter. Words are a thing today. Words are a thing. Okay, I should have enough money. It's only like 10, right? 20! Okay, good. Glad I have 20 then. Jeez. Um, so here is actually a required thing. Um, the diving game. We need to pick up all the rupees that I, he throws. And I just skipped ahead. You have limited time, blah blah blah. And come back up here when you're done to get a prize. So this first time it's pretty easy because there's there's only five rupees. Um, it's because we can't really dive very well. So yeah. There we are. Hey, congrats! I got something very nice for you. Come and get it. Once again, reminding you to come back and talk to him and not just plain leave. Not that I was one of those people, but I have seen people play that game then just leave. Like, oh my gosh. How do you miss it? He tells you twice. Anyways, let's not get into other people's playthroughs. We're currently on my playthrough. Now 
now as we the cameraman is drowning under the water what a graceful dive now please take this this is a scale of our kind with this you can dive much deeper under the water because that makes sense right anyways the silver scale we can now whoa, we can now dive deeper but I I should honestly um um, it's worth, it's kind of worth playing this game again, just for the, the, you get a lot of rupees from this, and especially if he drops the gosh dang 50 rupees, which I'm pretty sure he just did, or, oh god. Well, I'm already failing miserably, so, like, I've already made my money back with one dive. So is that, that's a 50 rupee, correct? Correct. And is that another 50 rupee down there? You don't honestly have to get all the rupees. You just have to get enough rupees to win your money back, basically. And oh my gosh, he threw freaking two 50 rupees. That's like unheard of. Oh, wow, my wallet is already pretty much full again. I'm surprised about that, in all honesty. And hey, congratulations. Okay, that just means I got all the rupees. Honestly, you don't, it's not like he takes your rupees away if you fail that game, so... Um... I'm glad I got all that money, because I'll be... I'll be able to get more beans. Because <laughs> that's my main concern. Beans! Beans! Anyways. So... You should be able to see that, uh... Shortcut down there, and you... Hopefully the game is pr hoping that you are in wonderment about what's down there, and you swim. Come out to the lake, and then hey, there's also this bottle. He got an empty bottle. Put something. In, uh, uh, hold on, what? There's already something inside. Okay, so that's that's the weird empty bottle that's not empty. <laughs> oh my God, it's 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 a huge deal. Uh, it's nightmares, catastrophe, chaos. I have no idea. Anyways, this is something else we need to do while we're here. This is Bonoru, the Scarecrow, musical genius. Hear a song once and I never forget it. So basically we have to play a song for him. This is useful later, so in the game, so we, this is good. And what do I want to play in all honesty? Shall I be lazy and just do nothing? I will be lazy and do nothing apparently. <laughs> I kind of, I've always preferred easy to remember and fast since uh, I don't know but that's my scarecrow song apparently behind him is Piero I believe or Pierre I uh, excuse me the wandering scarecrow he actually wanders around because he is a scarecrow right actually I wish I could wander oh he actually doesn't wander Back away slowly. Anyways, you can you can play whatever you want for him, and he'll remember a good decent. There is a limit of how many notes he can play, but he does remember a lot of notes. Okay, so what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Right, I'm heading to the middle of the lake. For reasons. Well, not specifically in the middle lake, but I'm heading over to Gabora because um, Gabora is, will provide us a shortcut to Hyrule Castle. As I said, I was going to do main quest and then side quest at the same time, and this is my convenient trip to Hyrule, tr Hyrule Castle, which I'm going to take. What are you doing? You've come a long way to get up here. You should look at the map subscreen sometimes, because you are lost! No, I'm here- I, like, shut up. <laughs> Anyways. He tells you about a water temple used to wor used to worship the water spirits. The Zoras are guardians of the temple, apparently. So, I guess he tells you a little bit about the Zoras, apparently. There are some Zoras around here by the lake, actually. Um, 
it, there, there's a couple spots where there'll just be bubbles, and if you approach them, then a Zora will appear. So you can meet the Zoras without being, uh, you know, royal family member or something like that. Okay. So, question is, can I get more red rupees from the, doing this again? Or is that just a one-time thing I can't? Oh yeah, I remember how it works. Every time you turn off the game, you can do that again. That's right. I think? Something along those lines. Anyways, now I got a ton of money again. Excellent. Because we are going to play bomb chew bowling. In fact, we can actually start buying bomb chews if I remember right. Maybe I should do that, or should I? I probably should just. Uh, oh gosh, dang it! Like bomb chews are, bomb chews are a problem in this game. You can't just go out and buy them whenever you want. You have to fend for them for crying out loud. Customer. So I just skipped all that, then I'm quite alright with that. Honestly, she's just explaining the game. Oh, and the, the the prize is always a secret, which is annoying. However, um that's actually what I want. And if I remember right, you can also win bomb chews from here, so there is actually Bomb by getting bomb chews is a is a kind of problematic in this game because I'll get into that later on when I go buy bomb chews apparently I think I don't know I, I, I should buy bomb chews but I need the money for the beans so I'm conflicted at the moment so by the way this is bomb chew bowling just hope and get lucky that chicken moves alright I won hooray <laughs> Other options involve going up walls, because bomb shoes can do that. However, I, I never had the show... Well, actually, technically they go up the walls in the back of the room, so technically I did show that. So, we can play again and try to get heart pieces, rupees, bombs, and bomb shoes. But I'm not going to try that. Honestly, I'm glad I got that. That was like the first prize and I got that right away. That was nice. Oh, a uh, fun tip. Up here are rupees. At night, there's a five rupee instead of five green rupees. Yay. Okay, so... Buy bomb shoes, get beans. Buy bomb shoes, get beans. Buy bomb shoes, get... Do something else since I'm here. Yeah, yeah, Sarah. Okay. Oh, and since I'm here, I should maybe get that? Eh. Later. I was thinking about maybe starting the mask quest or whatever. Okay. Let's, since we're here, we should take up that fairy's advice and visit the for fairy. Although, uh, did I skip that dialogue? I'm not even sure. Anyways, um, since I'm here, I can show this off. Showing off, you can bribe the guard, you can't, I believe it works where the first time you enter this area, he will not take the bribe, but the second time, if you leave the area and come back, he should then take bribes, if I remember right. A fun little thing, I guess. Also, my only way of getting into the castle, at least my first time playing through the game, since I didn't understand the concept of climbing the vines in the middle in the exact look okay okay let's not go ranting but and here we have a fairy fountain hooray and this one is also required at least as far as I understand due to one specific area of the game this is required Welcome, Mr. T. I'm the great fairy of magic. <laughs> I will give you a magic spell. Please take it. <laughs> I am Italian plumber. 
Oh, gosh dang it. Uh, gosh, that's... This is honestly the last thing I'm leaving the episode on. Gosh dang it, that's just hilarious. You got Din's fire! Its fireball engulfs everything! Ah! Its attack magic you can use with C. You can use the Din's fire not only to attack, but also to burn things! <laughs> When battle has made you worry, please come back to see me. God dang it. Ah, oh, gosh, I, I'm, I'm ashamed now. <laughs> oh dear, okay, so at any rate, this has been the Green Lenny Mr. T. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. And to you I say, Aloha!